Most baseball fans grow up dreaming of playing a game in a big league park. But for some, dreaming isn't enough. For those fans, there's Dream Week, when grown-ups get to live out their childhood dreams of playing on the big stage. Get through, get through, there you go. The Orioles have been running Dream Week since the 1980s, and it never ceases to draw a crowd. I always say to them, you know, the first thing I say to them, take it easy, you're not going to get drafted. You know, you're past that point. But it's, I think it's the kind of game, baseball, just it lends itself to this, and it gives these guys a, an appreciation, and girls, an appreciation for what the major leaguers go through. And playing a game at Camden Yards is just the beginning. These campers will head down to Sarasota, Florida in January. There, they'll get instructions from O's legends and put it to use against camp squads from other MLB teams. Well, at first, you're very nervous. You're thinking, oh my God, it's Chris Hoyles. Oh, it's Scotty McGregor. You know, it's Jim Palmer. Then you realize after a while, the regular guys, they like to drink beer, have fun, they're competitive. And because the same guys generally keep coming back, you get really close. You get on a first name basis and you're like, wow, this is really special. Many campers haven't swung a bat since high school or even Little League. They come to play the game they fell in love with one more time. But they often come back, sometimes with friends and family members, for the bonds they make with their teammates and even former O's. It's a fraternity. You, you bond with these guys. You're with them all week. You, you're playing baseball with them. You're cracking jokes with them. You're having dinner with them, breakfast with them. I mean, you literally are a big family. Paul Mancano, MassInSports.com.